What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the JRD Motorsports vlog. It is another exciting day here. We've made it back to WMI where we have been building our brand new race car for the 2024 season all winter long. Although it doesn't look like much of a winter here in Canada. We uh, don't really have any snow, which is fine by me. Appreciate everybody clicking on today's upload. Uh, we're over a thousand subscribers, so make sure you hit that subscribe button for us and make sure you comment and like our videos and go back in time and watch everything to do with this build. Today, we are wrapping the race car. We're gonna get some color on this bad boy and uh, show off what our colors are officially gonna be for the 2024 season. So stick around. All right, we got a lot of that to take off. Wow! We got a whole car's worth to take off on this thing. All right, boys, let's start getting some of this here safety plastic off. In a rare sight these days, Aiden's made his way back to the shop. Where have you been, young grasshopper? Work. Oh, no excuse. This is your job. High paying volunteer work on the Jerry Moore first thing. Yeah. So we think we might need some step ladders. Just, uh, yeah, you're done. So come on, T-Rexes. So these are our two primary colors, obviously, other than white and the back bumper. She's got a nice booty on her. Uh, this is our blue. We are sticking with our blue. Obviously, we did the entire chassis that color. God damn. So this blue is unbelievably cool. So obviously we're gonna stick with that. Douglas blue. And this is our secondary color for 2024 and beyond with our new partnership with Bingo Country. I like gold. I'm gonna go with some gold. Our neon yellow days are officially over. Put these two colors together. Bring it in, Aiden. Show the people. That's just sexy. I don't care what you say. So here we go. It's pretty good looking. Uh, we got a metallic gold and obviously our metallic fire blue or whatever it's called. Um, those are our two colors for this season. And then obviously are white and black. Uh, other than that, we shouldn't really have too many colors on the race car. Neon yellow days are over. Um, what do you say we get some vinyl going here, boys? Well, Jamie and I are gonna start getting some of the vinyl work. I'm vlogging over here! Knocking everything off the tables. Unbelievable. So while Jamie and I are gonna be starting to get some of the vinyl done, we're gonna get Frank and Aiden over here and they're gonna be getting some of the motor cleaned up uh, a couple of vlogs ago i talked about how it bothers me with these cast iron blocks that they rust a little bit even though it's a brand new you know ten fifteen thousand dollar engine um so these two are going to get some stuff on it and clean it and then we're just going to put a little bit of paint on uh, the rusty parts i'll uh, flip the camera around and show what i'm talking about so this here high horsepower high torque motor obviously they get a little bit of rust on them which is just the stupidest thing ever um so these guys are gonna get it cleaned up and we're gonna get just on those two, just those two little spots is, uh, on the front and the back of the block is the only thing that uh, gets rusty. So these guys are gonna get that cleaned up, but uh, with a little bit of rusties and a little bit of lock, you too can look like me. Nope. What the hell? <laughs> Who is that? Well, it's probably Nathan. He does love him. Yeah.
All right, there we go. The boys have spray painted. Frank did a good job masking. James did a good job spray painting. And uh, for about six and a half cents of spray paint, she looks good. I'm happy. Good job, boys. Okay. Why, why would we not have done that would be my question. Like, I know lots of people do it for that exact same reason, so. I'm happy, I'm happy with that. I hate rust, I like good looking stuff. So speaking of good looking stuff, we're gonna keep wrapping over here. Um, first piece of vinyls on the car, I just gotta cut it. So that is awesome. Um, oh yeah, I'm looking at it. We're not gonna show the entire paint scheme or the whole wrap or anything until Motorama in five weeks. So you have to stick around and stay tuned for the next five weeks and beyond. To, to check out the full paint scheme, but uh, we'll show bits and pieces of it. And you've seen the colors and you've seen the car and stuff. So, um, man, this is good. I know I say it every year and as a, as a person who designs race cars and all that kind of stuff for a living, it takes me a long time. I have to challenge myself a lot to, uh, to get something I like, but I really do think that uh, this year's paint scheme is gonna be our best looking race car ever. So you'll have to just keep following along. And uh, if you're in the area, make sure you come by to Motorama and check out the WMI booth. and. If you're at the WMI booth, you might as well order yourself one of the best race cars, or the best race car, um, anywhere. You might as well order one while you're there. Okay, what do you want? Bro? I don't know how I managed to get a little crease. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. ASMR, go! Here we go, Blue's making his vlog debut. Did you give me a new shop dog? I say no, that's Zoe's job. <laughs> Eleven, I guess. Well, you could just cut. What's you that? could just cut 11 twice. What's that take you to? What is it, 60 and then one, it'll be 120. What do you need? 105. So just do that. We'll just do the nose of two. Seems wild to me. Where's the knife? Yeah, this thing is on the table. Well, it's been a long day here. Um, got a lot of help today which is awesome i appreciate everyone's help all the team guys and everyone who came out and uh we made some deals to do some really cool exciting stuff too today which is going to be awesome and uh, you'll see in the next probably month so um i'll flip around and show the progress we got today um just about gonna get the headlight stickers on and stuff and then we'll call her a day here but uh this is about as much of a preview as you're gonna get until uh until we unveil this thing at motor ram and wait until you see the scheme unveil that we have planned but uh, let me show flip around and show what we got done on the car here so far today so she's looking pretty slick. Got to get the headlights and everything in there still and the fog lights and all that, which we're going to do right now. And uh, maybe I'll make that the thumbnail picture. Uh, but uh, other than that, she's looking pretty slick. And then uh, obviously we got the sides and everything done, as you saw. But that's going to do it for another day here in the uh, Jared Motorsports vlog at the WMI race shop. Um, we're going to be back hopefully next week dropping the engine in since as you saw we got the engine and everything done with that. And uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button for us. We're over a thousand. We're well over a thousand now which has happened pretty quick. So make sure you hit that subscribe button for us. Comment below what you uh, what you think of what we've got going on for the race season so far. We're hoping to release our schedule in the coming weeks here as we uh, get all of our events planned and tracks release our schedules and stuff. We, uh, we got some stuff we're still considering. So uh, like I said, hit that subscribe button. Make sure you like the video. 
as we got lots more content coming as we gear to unveil this thing at Motorama in Toronto in the second week or first weekend of March and uh, get ready for an awesome 2024 race season.